Hey guys, this is Kirob speaking and today we are back in Sim Golf, the ultimate classic of Sid Meier uh, from 2002? Golden, golden time of gaming? Golden age? And this game has so much charm. Last episode we upgraded our castle and we designed a new hole, which uh, sucks ass. What did we design too? Can't even remember. Probably two, yes. Uh, yes, we did. And this one, quite nice. This one supposedly sucks ass. But that is just because it is a par 4, even though it's supposed to be a par 3. And as you can see, it plays exactly like a par 3 should. Yeah. Not good. So, no one has any fun because everyone thinks, Oh no, it's another dog leg to the right! I hate dog legs to the right because we just played one. Well, fuck you. Uh, also, I have a newsflash for you. This is actually a par 3. So, it doesn't have a dog leg. Or anything like that. So what I'm going to do now, even though I am picky is playing and we need that fucking last bit of terrain, uh, is to start a tournament to get rid of this stupid rating. So let's go. 768,000 first price. We did get a few extra stats last match play we had and this is looking decent enough. Number of holes, we do have 15 right now, yes. Okay, great, let's begin the games. Mm, well, Golf XE has stopped working. That's not good, is it? So it can't run the tournament. I wonder why. Probably some placement of towers? Hmm... Well, it's saved right where we left off, so uh, should we try again? If it's a proper computer program, it should crash just like it just did. Oh no, we're not quite done yet. Oh, we're on the last hole. Alright. Okay, cash grab completed. And we save the current game so that we can return here. And let's start again. And yes, it crashes again. Hmm, so what do we do against that? Should we try to... to just make sure that... Oh, maybe the castle is on one of the points where the TV towers were? Hmm, I don't know. Oh, maybe I can change it here? Could I? Can I somehow change it here? What do these even mean? Ah, uh, home site values, stuff like that, okay. All right, I'm changing around the green a bit, even a bit more. So we do have a pot bunker in front, and then just a deep rough runoff area. Yeah, that might work a bit better. This just doesn't play quite right. All right, now we have completed another year. My ratings have improved again slightly. I gained two no more members, but we still haven't solved the problem. And we still haven't managed to run a tournament to... <clears throat> to fix the problem. Whilst the game crashes, but I hope I can do that now. So we do have an autosave now. Uh, at that spot. I think at least. Let's see if we... If we can get that. Done, save the current game. Yeah, let's keep it there. And now, let's try again. Crash the game. See what happens. Yeah, okay, it still crashes it. Ah, oh, man, how are we going to find out what is causing this so that we can change it? Okay, I am picky is now on ninth. He's doing pretty well so far. I'm just shot into the water, though. <laughs> boom Boom is challenging me again. All right, should we do that? Should we do that to grab? Uh, I, feel, I feel for that that fella. He, he has been drowned of cash already. Um, one thing we could do with this one, this hole, is to make it a little more interesting to have an island here somewhere at, like right in front of the green, where you could try to hit it to, so that you don't have to play around. But that would also make it a lot easier. Then you would have to hit up onto the cliff, though, <laughs> which is quite interesting. Uh, yeah, maybe. Maybe it would have to be small. Because this hole is... Wow. Okay, 2.2 imagination skill. 
That's not bad. Look at how hard this thing is. This is crazy. Maybe you shouldn't change this one. Maybe you should change this one, because this one is not quite as fun as it should be. 86%. Accuracy outstanding, yeah, I can see that. Maybe I just need to have a bit of a slope change. This is all flat. This is not flat there. This is... Mm, yeah... Not too convinced. Like, making this flat might help slightly. And if we up this one, this one is up too, then there's a bit of a stopper so that it doesn't roll onto this pot bunker. So maybe this works out a bit better. We can give this a go. And we can also make all of these be at the bottom level. Yeah, yeah, I can see this work a little better. At least then some of the precision shots that are placed close to the pot bunkers aren't as random in their directional change once they stop down or once they come down. This could work a bit better. Let's uh, see what they would play from there. Yeah, that works out. While we're waiting for I Am Picky to uh, do his thing and crush the cause, uh, we can just play a little practice round. Come on, Kirob. Where are you? Oh, yeah. Got a skill upgrade. Now we're back up to 100% in high backspin shot. And are we going for the long drive again? I believe we are. Let's see if we can get across the pond. Bam! Yes, this is looking good. Go, 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 go. Yes. Oh, I see what's going on. Oh, this is all fucked. Look at that. There's a massive backstop because he's stuck. He is currently stuck, and I don't know why. Okay, let's let's kick him and see if that helps. Yes, yes it does. Okay, now they can start playing again. Oh. Oh, that click made me hit it over there. I'm supposed to be there, somehow. All right, all right, I'm picky is happy with everything uh, so far. He's now playing the last hole. Well, we know how that will go, but uh, still. I hope it won't be too bad. Let's hope he doesn't eagle it. Oh, yes. Yes, he has approved our expansion. Oh, that has come down in price. All right, let's buy it. There we go. Yes, a new piece of land, finally. Finally. That's not much room, though. We will have to win some land in order to complete our 18-hall course. But that should be possible because this is... We only need three more halls. But all of them need to be par fours. Oof. Yeah. I think that will work. So I saved the current game and let's try another go at playing a tournament. Or do I have to... Hmm, fuck. I have to finish up my practice round, don't I? Why can't I cancel that? Oh, long driver skill improves to 80%. That's a great haul for improving your skills because of this cannon, I assume. There are way too many problems with this course right now, and I don't quite... Well, that that, that was probably lost because of the, the hiccup here, where we had to kick a member. And then one left because everyone was queued up so badly. So maybe, it, maybe it's fine now. I would hope it is. Certainly keeping them, them awake. But this is still terrible. We need to fix this. But the game crashes when I try to fix it. Ugh. Oh, happy ending. Oh, nice. That's our first happy ending. I didn't uh, didn't want any yet, but that works. So now we have a building there that gives happiness to golfers. You can need that. These buildings, like the happy endings, buildings and stuff, I want to actually place in strategic positions once the course is fully designed. Because we still have so many things to place down here. 
like when we look at this and the these things um there are quite a few like the lighthouse and stuff which give you happy endings which makes sense to place towards the end of the course when the stories have progressed enough that the the members playing get over time um but yeah that is something I wanted to do later. But if they are placing down their own stuff already, then I won't complain. I think what would make a lot of sense is to place one of those special buildings here because so many T's would be affected by it. So let's do that now. Let's find one that really fits there. And that could be something with happy endings because this is towards the end of the course already. Um, maybe the lighthouse. That encompasses them all, that's for sure. Stonehenge, happy endings, yeah, but only has the range of two of them. So I think it needs to be the lighthouse. Uh, but then again... Uh oh. <laughs> if I demolish it, do I still have it? <laughs> because that is... <laughs> I'm so stupid. Boop. <laughs> bye bye. Yeah, I still have it. Okay, good. Because this fucking piece of land is in the wrong place. We need to have that one demolished uh, by placing water there and... Oh, well, water. I have to put it down. Because this is not where it's supposed to go. It's supposed to go there. Um, all right. Okay, now we place it there. That might be better. Uh, it's a little ugly down there with the... Uh, the water sitting there, but I mean, so what? It's well hidden if we look at it from our usual perspective. And I think what may, might make this all more interesting is if we lower the last portion of the green so that it's always a downhill shot and the, it funnels the ball a little bit towards the flag if you hit it long enough. Ah! Okay, now both of them are only saying, oh, nice downhill shot, instead of, oh, another dog leg right. Oh, gold member. What? We have one gold member. That's the first one. And we just finally finished our fucking practice round. How great is that? So now I can uh, place another save and try to crash the game again. Yeah, it still crashes the fucking game. No! <laughs> How are we ever going to get rid of this damn par 4 that is a par 3? Maybe we can get around this by designing the next hole? Maybe something changes and the game no longer crashes? I don't know. We do have the money. We don't need I am picky to come again. Oh, let's hope for the best then. Uh, definitely... Oh, I could change the, this hole for now to... Oh no, I don't want to be too close to this fairway because then they want to play it there. No, that's, that's too bad. That's too bad. No, I can't change this. Mm, maybe I, I could go like this, this, and then into the ocean, or I could play from here, close to the snack bar. Um, yeah, yeah, don't want to have another supposed dog leg to the right. How do I avoid this? Well, I could go straight there and then out into the ocean. Have a, have a green over there. And then play back to there. And then out to here. And that would be it then. Before we place down anything, just check distances. So if we start from here, we have just... Ah, uh, fuck! Resets when you reach the end of the screen. Uh, we have 300 yards there. And then we would have another 120-ish if we place the green over there. And then we could work from... I actually have a, part, a short path for. But a tricky one now. A short puffer would have to be... Ah, fuck! That's, that's a nasty little bug. Um, this one could be a short par four. Very reachable, but difficult green. Tiny green in the ocean, maybe. 
and then a tea box right next to it so that the first oh the tea box can be there <laughs> you have to have at least 200 yards range to get onto land mm, maybe not i feel much more comfortable designing the last hole that would certainly be something of this kind starting here there then shortish layup to here and then another fairway and then green over here that will be cool all right let's start out by placing the green right there <laughs> hole number 16 beautiful okay i'm i'm happy with this one um we can use uh, should we use a shared fairway here we can deliberately do that um yeah i think they would abuse it anyway so if we put a tea box over there in the water that could work like there play from there use the same bridge to get back doesn't look too pretty right now but uh, that can be fixed up now let's open this one and then we can place a tea box over there and they have to hit to um over there maybe I want to play the, uh, have this one play straight. 375 yards might not be enough for these these guys. Can uh, have that be on a pretty steep hill or have the landing area on a steep hill so that uh, yeah, let's do that so that it plays longer than it actually is. So this is about 240 yards here. So let's make this entire area an upslope. Oh, this is very different. This hole is very, very different. Love it. Right. Uh, quite slopey, this whole thing. I still need some more fairway because this is ridiculous. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, I think it will play well. Let's have another quick look here. So we are... Uh, I've extended the fairway a bit so that short hitters don't have to hit it over, this, over to this fairway. It's still better to go over here. Um, like that, yes. So we are hitting uphill and it is super tight where people would want to land it. But this is a little too tight, I would say. So there's no real option for playing it short. And if you're a real long hitter, then you can hit it all the way up here, bounce it there and then have it roll down and funnel to the green. But I don't like this to be there it needs to be a little more slopey this shouldn't be too easy is it no not really so there's two two this is up sloping that way that is sloping that way kind of now this is straight up as well this is straight up good so it doesn't roll off into the gauze necessarily this slope might be a little crazy hmm not sure about that as soon as you hit anything here, it will just like speed through. And there's a bit of a funnel to keep them there if you're very precise, but still, this looks scary as fuck. Well, I think that can work. It looks beautiful. And no pot bunkers here, though. Where, where are my pot bunkers? There's a bit of pine forest. Eh, maybe we don't need any here. This one could be one. Yeah, let's place a pot bunker there. That's looking about right. This is still fucking ugly. I need to really build that island. And that requires me to finish off the last hole because that will be built in the middle of the ocean. All right, let's open up that hole. 17th, a scenic 400 yard uphill par four. But also suppose a dog leg? This is not a dog leg. Fuck. Ah, oh, will they be complaining about being dog legs again in the same direction? Ah, uh, that's not good. Ah, uh, no. Can I reset that? Yeah, I kind of have to. Um, um, if I place, place it there, does it count as a dog leg or is this counting as straight? Let's open it. Okay, this is straight. This is counting straight. 
Very nice. <laughs> this is this one field of difference did make the difference. Uh, yeah. Now, how do we get over here to this island? Maybe we can. Uh, we can make this into gorse or something. I need to design this island now and a path how to get onto it. Also, speaking of that, I don't think I have fully designed the height map for the previous hole yet. This is looking a lot better. So oh, this makes it super interesting. You're actually going to play onto on the top of a cliff. Oh, yeah, it's slightly above the hole. And then you have to chip down towards the green with a lot of precision. Uh, I'm going to put the path here at the side and then over there and then towards the green. Hmm, I'm wondering how they will react to this. If I just build the pathway like here and they have to drive back. Horrible layout, but uh, I don't want to mess with this area specifically because that is so daunting to hit over the ocean. Even though it's short, I mean for the short hitters, that will be very daunting. For the long hitters, it doesn't matter. And they wouldn't get in the way here anyway. So I think that could work out. And I'd rather go to um, the next hall and finish designing that one than mess around with destroying this area because this will be water for the next hall as well. And the next hall needs to start over here somewhere. Let's put it on a... Yeah, on the sides. On the sides. Like right there. And this will be an epic par 4 in the ocean. There we have it. Hole number 18. 437 yards right now. Because it has to reroute weirdly. How do we lay this one out? I think... Uh, because of how dramatic it needs to be. It needs to be a bit of an island hopper. Um, that might be a bit strange for Link's course. But we can we can spice this up. This is not supposed to be Galiga from uh, from Shot Online or something. So it still needs to look natural. Uh, this is a costly hole. Holy shit! Oh man, this will be cool. Um, historic lighthouse. We put that out here, and we can put a windmill there. That is also. Wow, do we do we actually need that? Happy endings would be more appropriate. Do we have another happy endings? Happy golfers, yes. Stonehenge's happy endings. I think this is now at least laid out. This doesn't look half bad. Just hope that they are not trying to play from there to there. And then over there. That might be an option, so I might want to put some scenic trees here so that they are barred from doing that and that they have to play a draw round if they want to land on this fairway. Oh yeah, that's quite nasty. <laughs> Maybe I want to reset this one. And of course, tricky green it is. There we go. And I do want to put this one up a bit. because It is perfectly situated on a an island anyway. So this can be on a natural cliff that never existed before. Um, at five, maybe? All right, that way now leads up to the green. This is rather impressive. Okay, let's open it up. This will double your tournament prize monies, yes. Hmm. So the, the green even is a little slopey. Uh, is this too much? This is a little bit too much. Let's tune it down slightly. Just ever so slightly. Like this. One down, everything one down, basically. Yeah, that's a bit better. Less extreme. Still the same effect. Still the same slopes. And how about we make this a little more interesting? It's co completely flat right now. That's looking better. Slightly helping to keep the drives, the long, very long drives, um, in check over there. And here I believe we are going to make something a little nasty so that it's running towards the water, but not too much. So you've got to be careful. 
And that should be it. That should be it. We've done it. Wow. We somehow squeezed that in. Nice. Weird complex uh, of, of chain of islands over here. But uh, yeah. Quite, uh, quite good looking. And I hope it plays well, but I, I would assume it does. But the most important thing, actually, would be to check out if we now can run a tournament without crashing. So I have two. Oh, wait a second. There. Oh. First 18 hole course. So we do get. We do get another few skill points. What do we want to put this into? We have been losing recovery skills like crazy. And never really got the draw shot and fade shot up there. Maybe we try to get back some accurate irons? Although long driver seems... No, uh, long driver is dangerous. Accurate driver seems more useful in that sense. So let's put all in that. Okay, there we go. So if we check out the course report, we ha should have par 73. Yep, we do. And that one doesn't have any averages. No one has played them, of course. And as soon as this one becomes a par 3, we will... Oh, is it this one? Yes, this one becomes a par 3. We will be able to have a par 72 as it should be. And I hope that people will like it. Um, we need to save the game and then try to run another tournament. So I did save the game and... Oh, no! Oh no, what the fuck? We only have... We only have eight scenic holes? We only have six imagination holes? We need nine? All right. Hmm. I guess they need to uh, play these holes first so that we can see that they are working and get some ratings going. Oh, looks like we've had a few more happy endings. Three? Really? Anyway, our rating should now go up pretty quickly as... Oh, yeah. Uh, as... No, there's just one happy ending. Uh, we are getting those holes played. Oh, here comes a shot. Here comes a shot. Oh, landing it on top. And how far would it... Oh, oh that rolls into the pot bucket. <laughs> oh, that was a good one. Holy shit. That was a really good one. Yep. Yeah, that was a really good one. And with the bridge, that's working out reasonable. Oop, oop, there was a ball coming. He didn't care, though. He was in his buggy, just riding along. Maybe they have uh, heavily armored buggies. This is overall looking a lot better, though. The course is no longer getting traffic stops. I think I have everything in place. Or we have just had so many people resign. <laughs> <laughs> fuck off, because they are getting too many egos, as you can see, um, <clears throat> that we no longer have traffic problems that way because of that. It might be the case. Yeah, oh, there are some who are the gold members. They are now riding around in gold carts. Yeah, that's pretty cool. There are no people out playing the course, though. Do we actually have too many people resign? This is not looking good. Are we actually losing money? That's not looking good. Oh, is it the... Oh, no. That is why. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Okay, someone has screwed up again. I think we need to transport the bridge over there. Let's fix this instantly. So, let's remove this one. And let's remove all that. Like this. And put some water there. Oh, can he now? Is he now getting it? Nope. Okay. Uh, that is not looking good. Fuck. Do I have to kick him? Yeah, I guess so. Okay, now they're playing again. But man, that's not good. Oh, that's not good. It's really not good. Fucking bugs. How the hell did he manage this round? What? What? 
Is that even possible? Holy shit. All right, things are looking up again. Just slightly. After we fix the the little bug there. Uh, people getting stuck. Maybe it's because of the road layout there. And that should now be fixed. Ah, imagination holes. Right now seven. We need two more. The rest of the requirements are now met. After a little while, we can now check out our course report and see... Ooh, Hole 18 sucks! Why does it suck so much? Just because it's way too difficult? Average score is 5.36. That's insane. So while we are waiting for more Im imagination holes... Uh, where, where is everyone? Shit, where is everyone? Is this the stuck people? Stuck people need to appear. Yeah, there they are riding. Okay. More coming. Um, yes. Well, uh, while we are waiting, let's see where we can place the rest of our special buildings. First, let's place the skill upgrade one. Oh, what? Wait, wait, what? After 16th? What happened? After at 16th or uh, are you kidding me? Fun, no fun, but what what was the cause of it? Why? Were you disgusted by getting a birdie or something? Or playing a par? What? Oh, there's a happy ending. Another happy ending. Holy shit. <laughs> Another what what was this? Uh it, what is this? Come on, tell me at least what it is. Some kind of mini lighthouse or so. Makes happy golfers or something. Let's check. Yeah, must be this one. But it doesn't tell me now. I think a barn would look kind of nice up here. It doesn't really do anything, but uh, well, it could be up there in the gorse. That's not in play necessarily. Yeah, let's put it there. Oh, kind of cute. Yeah, I like that. Skill upgrade. How about placing this here? Yeah, let's do this. It's pretty cool. It's a good range. Good, good, yeah, well, good range for covering this green, this T, and this T. Stonehenge happy endings, maybe here somewhere? Yeah. Uh, this doesn't quite cover both. Oh, this that would cover both. Yeah, let's put it there. Oh, what? Ah, oh, man, what's going on here now? What happened there? Holy shit, these golfers are insane. What happened? That ball almost hit her. Okay. Did someone, someone play for... What? W what? I don't get it. She completed hole 16. This is 16. She actually played down here. Oh, did she? No, wait a second. She didn't. Maybe we do need a way to get over there. Yeah, may we may need to. Let's try that. Let's try that. Skill upgrade. Where do we want to have another skill upgrade? Maybe right here on the first. That could work. Like there. Yes. Nice. Ah, oh, another happy ending. Yay, Stonehenge worked. Uh, what? What? What happened there? I, I really don't get... What? Uh-oh. Uh oh, Ivana Richmond is getting pissed off. I think we need a resort so that they just stay happier for longer. Where can we place it, though? It needs to be connected to the main thing as well. We could place it over here. <laughs> oh, but we don't have money. Oh, shit. I think we are in a pickle. We don't have money. People are just leaving because they are fucking stupid idiots. Well... Maybe they just don't appreciate a properly designed course. Okay, now they're riding over here. Nice. 
Very well. Yeah. And now they are no longer riding across this fairway where they might be a might be, get hit by balls. So that bridge certainly helped. What? <clears throat> On number 16, this guy. Uh, I don't get it. I really don't get why they have such short tempers. I mean, he has been playing shit all day. Well, not shit. Not that decent. Decent, actually. Um, just made a birdie. 16th comes along. And he throws his clubs in the water? What? Why? And my course is completely empty. Where is everyone? This is not going well. This is not going well at all. 30... We have decreased our membership to 35 now. Uh, mostly because of idiocy and bugs. Well, excellent. Is there no tournament I can play? No, there's nothing. We need one more imagination heavy hole. Come on, can we get it? Oh, uh, we just got something new. Just got another one. Let's see what it is. Oh, Easter Island Head. Happy endings. <laughs> Should we put it here? <laughs> that could work. Yeah, boom. There we go. If no one else wants to play the course, then I guess Kirob needs to. We need some money. Come on, play. Play it. Kirob, go play it. Okay, good first shot. Let's see how close we get. It's looking very nice. Do we get a skill upgrade? No. Oh, yeah. There we go. Because of the statue there. Perfect. No, we could actually drive this now. <laughs> All the way over there, but no, I'm not going to. Oh, fuck. Okay. Uh, well, that happened right in front of the ranger. Uh, but man... This is getting on me nerves. We've made it a little too harsh, I believe. We've made it a little too harsh. Or they are just so stupid and pissy, those bastards, that they can't appreciate a proper Lynx course. I mean, he just, just resigned and wanted to punch people after, uh, from a pot bunker, not getting onto the green. Well, that happens. Solution, don't get into the pot bunker in the first place. Big drive over the pond. We can reach no problem now. Uh, I, I hope that holds true now, though. See? Come on, Kerob. Bam! Yes. Yeah. Oh, oh that wasn't too easy, though. <laughs> I am picky. Eight is now playing my course, but uh, well, we have all the land that is possible to purchase. Well, I don't know why he's still coming. And they are still saying that we are supposedly uh, going to buy land from him. Nope, we're not. And we have no cash and we're right now not gaining any cash. Accurate irons plus 10%. Nice. Oh no, not another one. On hole number 16. What are they doing? So... He just shot it into the water, and now he's pissed, and he resigns from the golf club. That seems a bit of an overreaction. Um, is this too hard, though? I don't, I don't think it is. Where was he shooting from? From there? Could turn that into fairway. I guess. Would that make sense? Yeah. Yeah, it looks decent enough. Um, tiny green there. Why would he go for it, though, from there? From gorse. Is the AI being a little too aggressive? People going for hero shots where they shouldn't? Oh, that shot being in range, that is something new. Like, completely in range like this. Let's try it out. Let's go straight over. Yeah, looking good. A little short, but it will bounce out. Yes, just barely. Just barely made through the gores. Live fairway, but still you... Oh, yeah, you can select it. Okay, good. 
Uh, I think I'm going to play a high spin shot like right next to there. We'll get a weird bounce. That should, should be fine. Come on, bounce forward. And break right back. Stop. Yeah, good shot. The population on the course has increased again. And thus we are also... Oh, ah. The big costs are coming in. Uh, and thus we've also getting a bit more money here. But and still not enough. Still not enough. I mean, just about keeping break even. Maybe we just need to put down the Buddha here. Yeah, right next right next to that hole. That famous hole. That now infamous hole. A worthy investment. Oh, that was a good one. 305 yard drive. Accurate driver improves to 100%. That was straight down the middle. Oh, <laughs> that was a good shot. That was a crazy good shot. So I had to play it short because of the slope I've built into the green so that it rolls on there and then down towards the flag and it ended up real close. And that improves to accurate irons 80%. We're continuously losing members. They're all dying off, all throwing their clubs in the water. But, uh, I think we have solved some of the issues. Let's see how it develops. Oh, and another one bites the dust. Was that him? No. After the eight, after the eighteenth. Was that him? But why? There must be something wrong here. Don't quite get what it is. Because he has not even hit a ball yet. And he play, just played a par on the last and three birdies before. He should be pretty happy. This round is going, he is on 64 shots after 17 holes. <laughs> that, what? That makes no sense. I think I know what it could be, maybe. This resort hotel thing makes that they stay happy for longer. So somehow, they seem to be dropping happiness just for no good reason. Like, look at him. He has been playing an excellent round. Nothing really bothering him. And his fun was like halfway down. Like, why? Ooh, that's some long driving there. Yeah, he won't have any bigger issues playing this hole. Unless hits the pot bunker. Let's see. No, no, this one is pretty straight. Looking good. Oh, no, stop. Stop. Are you kidding me? Stop. N no. No. <laughs> What was that bounce? I have to investigate what, what the hell was going on there. That was on a... S Where did it hit? Did it hit exactly there, which is on this square, so that it bounces th this way? Oh, man. Oh, man, that is nasty. Let's do it like this. Yeah, look at this, for instance. She has been playing really well for her lack of skill, that is. And... She was just saying this course is a masterpiece. And her fun rating is down in the toilet. Like, she will be giving up real soon. I have no clue why that is. Apart from that you somehow need to buy that resort hotel a lot earlier. Now finally playing these holes. Mm, let's see what we're doing. I could drive it there. Should I try to? That requires a super accurate drive. I don't think I want to. Let's go to safe option. Supposedly safe option. And another one resigns. Holy shit, this is crazy. Oh! <laughs> Did we actually sink it? On hole number 18? Uh, I, I think we did. <laughs> okay. That was a good shot. Played... Uh, what was that? A well, no, we haven't hold out yet. Supposedly, again, bugged, but uh, I don't mind. So we played a four, played a par. How unnecessary is that? Whenever it says we knocked it in the hole, it doesn't actually happen. We're losing members and money. Fuck. 
And another one. Our gold members are leaving as well. No, that is uh, pretty terrible. So how do we get out of this mess? I don't think we can. Because we can't afford building a resort hotel now. Maybe if we somehow got the uh, final hall that we need. Uh, how close are we? Oh, not close at Oh. Ideal minimum. Okay, no, that's fine. Oh, we can run this? Supposedly? Yes. Where, where's the option? There, there's the option. Okay. I mean, we could win this thing. We could actually win this thing. It is March, so it's start of the year. We have positive budget. I think this could work out. We saved the current game, in case this tournament takes more than two years. It could very well be. And let's start it. Oh, well, we had to save it as well because of the potential crash. And yeah, it does crash. Hmm. So we can't actually play a tournament. We cannot get enough money to... Um, to actually buy that resort thing. So I guess we're kind of stuck. Oh, very nice though. We just played a 59. So <laughs> there, we, there we have 59 watch active. That's very good. And I think we just wrap up the let's play here because we're, we're stuck. We can't get enough money. We're just stagnant. Maybe if I... Uh, maybe I, I, I think I have another idea. I think I have another idea because there's Boom Boom. Boom Boom wants to play us. And Boom Boom gives us loads of money. And maybe thus we can buy the resort hotel at some point. And then we can have a sustainable course again. Hmm, is this something we want to do? Yeah, I think we, we will try next episode. There's one more in this. All right, hope you enjoyed and see you guys next time. <laughs>